Hi, this is Jeff Schofield, Remax Plus again, Rochester's biggest realtor. What I wanted to do is talk to you a little bit today about home improvements that have a good return on your investment. I'll break this down into two categories. You've got major improvements and minor improvements. Minor improvements would be stuff that costs, you know, a few hundred to maybe just a couple thousand. Major improvements would be new decks, new kitchens, new roof, new furnace, new central air, you know, things where you're going to spend a substantial amount of money. Now, most major improvements, if you're going, it will only have about a 50% return on your investment. Let me give you an example. If you're going from a nice cherry kitchen to a brand new maple kitchen, well, you're going from nice to nicer. So no, you're not going to get a major return on your investment. However, if you've got a roof that's shot, it's at the end of its useful life, it's leaking, you show stains in the you know, second floor ceilings, uh, well, you're not going to be able to sell unless you put a new roof on. So of course you're going to get at least 100, you know, or even two or 300% return. The same thing with a furnace that's not working. You've got to have a working furnace. To go from a furnace that's 10 years old to one that's newer, high efficiency, when they both work, no, you're not going to get 100% return. The items where you will get your largest return on your investment are the small items. The cleaning, professionally cleaning, the decluttering. Yes, we've all got a few too many things in our home that's not going to look good to the potential buyer. Painting. Be objective on painting and wallpaper. If you've got colors that only you love, if you've got you know, non-earth tone colors, then maybe it's time to neutralize. If you haven't repainted your house in the last three or four years, you probably really want to consider freshening it up. And the final thing that has a great return on the investment is floors. Your carpets need to be great. Your flooring needs to shine. It needs to be in good shape. If a lot of times homeowners say, well, I'm not going to replace this, you know, lime green shag carpeting because the next buyer is going to want to put in whatever color they want. Well, I got news for you. That buyer is going to see your home on the internet and they're not going to come look at it because they don't like the looks of your carpet. So if you'd like to chat with me about what you might want to do to your home during the next month or two to get it ready to go on the market, give me a call, send me an email, or send me a text. Jeff Schofield, Remax Plus, thanks for watching.